hello there dear youtubers my name is king1993 and today i'll be talking about another valkyrie character now before starting about that character i would like to say uh, that this video is more of a beginner's guide okay and this video is not gonna be anything about meta because i do not have enough money to buy all the weapons and the stigmata set for every single character so without further ado let's get started with the beginner's guide okay so today's character will be called fuha and there are total seven fuha archer of sentience uh, valkyrie epicenter or this augmentation is called uh, hawk of the fog okay this one is called night square this one is called shadow knight this one is called phoenix and finally this one is called azure empire okay now here is the thing uh, in case of their uh, physical or attack type okay there are total one two three okay this one two and three are considered as a physical demonstrator whereas this one and this hawk of the fog okay let me change this one uh, so this hawk of the fog and this shadow knight are lightning demonstrator and this one is a fire damage dealer and this one is a, a fire damage dealer and a support type okay now here's the thing out of all of these seven fu was only this one is considered as a pure support character and this one is considered as a support these two are considered as a dps character at the beginning part of your gameplay but as you progress throughout the game uh, at a uh, end game pace okay these two will eventually become a uh, elemental type elemental type uh, support uh, character okay so basically <laughs> that is how their role goes <sighs> now <coughs> uh, one important thing is this is the only exception now why is this one is the only exception now this one is considered as a dps as well as a support character basically speaking she can do support to the entire party and to herself as well and also at the same time her uh, physical attack damage is so high that she is considered as a uh, ex tier ex tier as in the top of the list of the physical damage dealer okay so that one strong is this one so that is basically the shortest description regarding these fuhua characters and the next part will be the weapon okay now let's start with the weapon section let's go to the weapon section and then select weapon and then i have selected the feast okay and afterwards let's uh, start with the six star one now this oblivion down is basically a pre-arm for this feng one down so if you have this feng one down then you can definitely upgrade it to oblivion down but the question is which of the uh, fuhua can actually take full advantage of this now if you were to re uh, read the description of this then you will definitely see that azure empire is a very good candidate candidate for this oblivion down so if you have uh, azure empire and for some reason if you do not have this cosmic duality then this oblivion down will be a very good option for you now this is uh, one of the point number one of azure empire another one for azure empire is this cosmic duality now cosmic duality is also uh, meant for support because if you were to read the description then you will eventually see that it will also help the teammates do far more uh, uh, elemental damage dealing so if you want your uh, teammates uh, main dps characters in the team that is if you want them to do a lot more physical damage sorry not physical i mean elemental damage dealing then this is a very good weapon and ex uh, another thing is this is actually the signature weapon for azure empire so this is a the best option the second best option is oblivion down okay now for the harsher of sentience uh, this is the best weapon for her the domain of sentience and this weapon is especially made for her so that you can take best advantage of this harsher of sentience okay now this one is belonging to shadow knight fuhua okay uh, the blue one let's see yep shadow knight so this not as revenge is basically for shadow knight fuhua and you can not only give it to shadow knight fuhua rather you can also give it to hawk of the fog okay remember not valkyrie apicitar rather hawk of the fog is the one and shadow knight is, uh, is the one there are these two 
uh, who was who can take full advantage of the because it has uh, lightning damage dealing capabilities okay now another one is this miracle uh, kc pillow now i uh, have not read the full description yet actually but it does seem like that okay it seems like that uh, this is not a very good option for the physical damage uh, dealing fuhua but if you do get it you can use it on her uh, you can use it on uh, fuhua but uh, this weapon is not gonna be uh, taken 100 percent of his usage on fuhua because this one is especially made for uh, carol okay so that is basically it for this weapon okay so that is basically it from this section okay so all of the weapon that i have shown you right now they are basically uh weapons that you must need to use crystals to get them so we must need a free alternative guide okay what is a free alternative guide let's go to this equipment section then click on force and then click on this uh punching gauntlet gauntlet icon okay so as you can see here there are these options okay now anyway so at the basic category there is this stellar vortex you can use this stellar vortex and if you were to read its description then you can see that this can only do physical damage dealing okay that is the main thing but the main other problem is that none of the other uh, options are av available unlike this one for example this one has bounty weapon and this bounty weapon can be transformed into a pre-arm whereas for this one you have only on one option at the, that is the stellar vortex and nothing else okay now as for this one this one is also a physical damage ceiling so when compared to this one i would suggest that you start with this one whatever this uh, cast x saint okay this cast x saint it does fire damage ceiling so if you have any of the fire fuhua such as azure empire or let's say uh phoenix then i suggest that you give this one to her okay other than that any of these other ones are actually not possible to get you must need to get the five star version of them then you can turn them into the six star uh, weapon category so that is a very sad thing about this forward and that is the weapon categories is extremely low okay now let's talk about the stigmata set okay let's select fuwa again and then we shall talk from over there so this uh, uh harsh of sentience this one's uh recommended set is the shattered sword set now why did i say shattered sword set because this uh, individual t m and b has different name azure empire sorry empire phoenix this one is called Sushang and this this one is called Raksha so but eventually if you were to read the description below then you will see it, all of these are called shattered sword set okay uh, do remember they are the same set now let's talk about this one for this one it is given the Ishikawa Goemon set which is a G3 stigmata set in the game for this one it is uh, shown that the uh, recommended set is monet set now monet set is a g2 stigmata set and ishika goemon is a g3 stigmata set so obviously if you were to give let's say hawk of the fog uh ishika goemon set then i also suggest that you give the same ishika goemon set to this shadow knight as well no difference okay now what about for this one for this one it is already uh, given a change okay at first it was some other stigma set but now uh, as i was looking for it i eventually saw that they just uh, gave the change and gave direct set as a recommended set for this fuhua okay so what the nebulous duality cosmic duality anyway now for this fuhua the recommended set is a g one stigmata set okay so all of these this noah and this 
Higoku Maru. All of these are G1 stigmata set. So if they are G1 stigmata set, then I highly recommend that just change them to G3 stigmata set and that is the Luven Hueck, then it will be far better. Now what about finally this one? For this one, okay. For this one, she has her own set, and this set is basically called Fuhua Margrave set. Okay, now Fuhua Margrave set is the best recommended set for this Fuhua because it will also make her into a DPS as well as a support character in the game. Now her support is so high that uh, in the uh, Marisa Honkai uh, tier list, she is considered as the number one elemental support damage dealer in the game okay so that much uh, important she is when she were to have her fuhua margrave set as well as this uh, nebula's duality okay so that much good she is okay even though i have shown you some of the uh, recommended stigmata set uh, the only problem is some of them are possible to get and some of them are not possible to get due to using crystals now let's talk about some uh, free alternative okay so go to this equipment section go to this stigmata and then select on force once you have done that okay i suggest that you first of all select the physical one let's talk about the physical one first so as you can probably uh, guess that the first one which i will start is from the basic stigmata set now from the basic stigmata set marco polo is a very good option you can give marco polo to any of the uh, physical damage dealing fuhua characters okay now as you go on to the upper section i highly suggest that you try to get ekaterina instead of anything else because ekaterina is the only uh, stigmata set uh, at g1 category which will be converted to the, into this michelangelo set and this michelangelo set will eventually be converted to direct and direct will be converted to alicia set now i have seen alicia set and alicia set is is actually very strong uh, set okay so as a result okay if you start with marco Polo at the beginning that is fine but as for this g1 g2 g3 and g4 you can start from this g2 as the michelangelo set and then eventually we'll start from this direct set and then you can eventually go to this alicia set no problem okay so this is a very good option now in case if you're wondering okay then why not start from direct and then go to alicia uh, do remember that it will take a large quantity of time for example getting one direct cost me about two months to get it so it will be a huge time and if you are not patient then you will have hard time getting it okay so that is the recommendation for the physical one now let's talk about the fire damage dealer okay now for the fire damage dealing uh, fuhua uh base set is this fuha musician set okay so this fuha musician set you can definitely give it to any of the fire damage dealing fuhas now as you go to the upper section you can basically give this hikoku maru set to any of the fire damage dealing fuhas okay now if you see that any of the other are capable of doing some team damage then give those team damage dealing uh, fuhas sorry uh, fire damage dealing set to azure empire if possible okay so all of these are dps categories so this hikokumoro can be transformed into thel set and then eventually this thel set can be transformed into this luvenu set but here's the thing if you want to get the maximum amount of damage dealing at the moment that is then getting two pieces of luvenu T and B and one pieces of Thales M will provide more damage dealing than three pieces of Luven Hoek. Okay, so this is a very recommended option. Now for the last one is this lightning damage dealing. Okay, now for the lightning damage dealing, for the basic stigmata set, this Darwin is a very good option. Now as you go to the upper section, this Nagamitsu is a very good option for the G1 and for G3, the Monet set is a very good option. Again, which I have said that. The monet set is a recommended set in the game currently right now for uh shadow knight fuhua but this is an old uh stigmata set i suggest that you upgrade to ishikawa goemon uh then you will have the maximum amount of damage ceiling okay
now we are finally at the elf section let's select the elf okay now for all of the physical damage during fuwa this is a very good option because this will destroy the enemy shield within a very short period of time but do remember that this is an a class for the s class uh, elf tesla zero is a very good option it will uh, do damage to the enemies as well as it will break the enemy shield as fast as possible as well okay now let's uh, start with the fire fuwa now for fire fuwa there are actually uh, three options available out of these three options this jingwe swing is useless okay this is an option but a useless option this one is a very good option because for the fire fuwa this will does fire damage as well as elemental damage so because of that this one is a very good option for the uh, fire damage dealing fuwa okay now as i scroll downwards there is sirin okay now sirin is the best option for uh fire damage ceiling fuwas because this will provide fire support healing as well as breaking shield so which is uh, triple its uh, capabilities so as a result if you were to have this set uh, sorry this elf in in your team then this will provide a large quantity of fire damage dealing to all of your fuwa characters okay so that is basically it for the fire damage dealing fuwa and last but not least is the lightning damage dealing fuwa for lightning damage dealing fuwa again this is a good option uh, it will uh, do uh, the elemental support okay but for the best option i suggest that you go with this lightning support bella because this one does provide lightning support and will also uh, defeat your enemies using lightning attack as well now this is another uh, best option these two are basically best option this is another best option so this one will definitely provide more lightning support okay to your lightning damage ceiling fuwa so that is basically it uh, let me rephrase it for the physical damage ceiling fuwa this and these are the be uh, best option except this one is the best or better than this one okay now for the fire damage ceiling fuwa this is the first best option the second best option is the serene okay and for the lightning damage ceiling fuwa this is a good option but the best option is uh, bella and this client okay okay so that is basically it for all of the fuwas that fuwa is a very easy set to understand there is nothing uh, complicated as much as it was complicated for the bronia set okay the, like the explaining the bronia set was way difficult for me than i actually thought okay but at the end of the day uh, another thing i forgot to show you that in case you were wondering okay how much good is the fuwa well here it is at the ex tier the best fuwa is the hasher of sentience the eight at eight year the this one i forgot the name night square okay this night square is the eight year option and this hawk of the fog is the uh, second best eight year option okay and at the b class as you can probably see this fuwa uh, shadow knight fuwa is at the b class so basically speaking this is fuwa on the entire list this fuwa i mean the fuwa character is all over the place that is one thing now another thing is uh, for the elemental support or for the physical support fuwa uh, this fuwa is also again at the top in the physical damage dealing and this the fuwa set is again on the top in the elemental damage dealing so basically speaking fuwa is basically an all rounder character in this game okay so that is basically it for this uh, marisa hunkai tier list okay <laughs> and another thing is i have been working on a certain website so that you guys can definitely go to this website and you can get even more information regarding many of the other things as well for example if you just click on this link then you will see that there are some other videos which i have 
already made and you can go watch them to understand about those characters as well okay so if you like this video then please give a like and subscribe and click the bell notification icon to get more of this type of content on a regular basis thank you